Hey guys, Med School Made Easy here with a common mnemonic uh, for congenital adrenal hyperplasia for your tests. Um, this also has a correction. I see people use this mnemonic or I hear them talk about it. They talk about it incorrectly all the time in regards to 11-beta uh, hydroxylase. In any case, these are the three most common types of hydroxylase deficiency, the enzyme that you're missing. Um, 21 is far and away the most common, so if you're going to guess one, guess 21. Um, the mnemonic involves you putting an A for aldosterone and a T for testosterone, right? Those two adrenal hormones. The one problem is, uh, and we'll talk about this in a little bit, instead of thinking about A for aldosterone level, think about it for hypertension, right? Which is a key manifestation of hyperaldosteronism, um, high blood pressure. But you'll see why in a little bit you can get tripped up if you think this is aldosterone and not hypertension. So we have A and T, t high testosterone leads to masculinization or virilization, right? Or people looking like men, etc. cetera. Um, the mnemonic is you just put each digit, so two, one, one, seven, and one, one into each column. And that's in theory the easy way to remember, hey, does 21 hydroxylase deficiency lead to an increase in blood pressure? And over here, you turn the ones into up arrows and that gives you your answer okay this is the problem that people run into that i see these mnemonics this is the uh the uh i don't know the, the pit that people fall into is that 11 beta hydroxylase deficiency doesn't increase your aldosterone but it does lead to uh, hypertension due to other pathways so in theory this mnemonic still works you can still put your up arrows and turn your ones into up arrows comma however you just need to know that this is not true hyperaldosteronism. It's just high blood pressure, hypertension. Um, anticipating a question, 17 alpha hydroxylase deficiency does lead to an increase in aldosteronism. So if you want to just remember A and T and whatever and just go for it and risk you being wrong here, that's okay. Um, but just know for completion's sake that um, uh, 21 causes virilization, 17 causes high blood pressure and high aldosteronism, and 11 causes high blood pressure, normal or decreased to normal aldosterone, um, and um, increased uh, testosterone. All right, thanks.